folk ballads, kind of, yeah. A lot of influence from Neil Young and his sort of storytelling. Uh, I wasn't doing as much music up north as I wanted to be, and I figured if I stayed in Kirikiri, I'd probably just stay there forever. So I figured if I moved down here, I'd get a fresh start and uh, try and focus more on my music. Yeah, I just wanted to continue on that singer-songwriter path. It's just what I've been wanting to do since I was little, so here I am. We get to come here almost every two weeks and perform um, for an audience, so yeah, it's, it's, it's really good fun. And then so I started listening to hip hop beats just because that's the best thing to freestyle to. Those beats were just pulled out better freestyles out of me. Hoping to be maybe one day I find a way to elevate. I guess there's a better state awaiting, but still I'm also happy in the present. Yeah, I meant it. I try to find another way to shape or bend it. Realize we're all the same. These days, over the past five years or so, I've gotten into uh, rap and electronic music and stuff as well, so I've been kind of blending all of those different pieces together to create something that's sort of, I guess, a bit unique in me. Studying at SIT has given me a lot of opportunities to sort of, sort of grow as an artist and a performer. It's a really good balance between the practical and theoretical because it's not too much of just one thing. Doing that part of it helps you understand like where the music comes from and the roots of it. We've got some of the best gear you could probably find in New Zealand. We've got great shooters. We all are there for a reason and all for the same reason, and it's just to play music and fall in love with music and it's really good to make some great friends doing this course. So in third year we do a tour, which is like a, a series of gigs. Being able to travel with other musicians and find out like sort of how it all works when you are on tour should be a really good learning experience. And another thing we get to do is put on our own concert. So we get to organise it and um, make sure we've got all the music and other musicians. And yeah, it should be really good. I was waiting for an external force to make things happen for me. And through the course, uh, it gave me the tools to realise that um, by looking at it more like a, a business and looking at where you can go with it into the future, um, it's just given me a whole lot of options for that. I think just being able to connect with other musicians has been the best thing for me and just being able to grow as an artist. Yeah, I just, I just want to perform for people and make people happy and have a good time and everything. So it's awesome. It's so much fun. You meet great people um, and you get to experience what it's like to be in front of a live audience. That's good fun.